G'day everyone, it's Angelo Ramora here, your favorite Australian and the real estate dingo, bringing you another awesome video blog. And today I'm talking to you about one word, one absolutely amazing word that will summarize your success in real estate. And that word is consistency. So let's get started. Since we're in the new year and we've hit the ground running, there's a little old thing out there and it's called the New Year's Resolution. And I'm sure that a ton of you know what that is because you were posting on Facebook throughout December about I'm gonna quit smoking, I'm gonna go to the gym and lose weight, and I'm gonna do all of these amazing things, right? Guys, let me tell you this. A goal not written down is just a wish. And when you wish for something, you might as well call Santa Claus and hope that he makes your wish come true. And I can tell you right now, as the real estate dingo, it's not going to happen. New Year's resolutions don't work. People still continue to smoke and they quit the gym after just a couple of months. Why? Because they are not consistent. They are not willing to work hard and because they have not written down their goals. They have also not written down targets that they want to achieve. So let's do this. What are your targets and goals for the next five years? Picture yourself in the future, five years from now. Where do you wanna be? What do you want your life to look like? What do you want your finances to look like? And whatever that is, let's hit it. Hit it five years from now, five year target. It's a target, not a resolution. It's a target, it's a written down thing. You can touch it, you can see it, you can feel it. It becomes a part of you because it's right in front of you, right? Five years, then let's backtrack. Where do you look? Where do you see yourself in three years? Backtrack. Where do you see yourself in one year? Backtrack even further. Where do you see yourself at in the in six months, three months, one month, one week, one day, one hour? If you really want to get extreme, like I do, fifteen-minute intervals. My calendar is packed out in fifteen-minute intervals, and every single one of these little things is getting me a step closer to where I need to be. Not a New Year's resolution, guys not a New Year's resolution. It is a written goal and a target five years in the future of where I wanna be and what I wanna be doing, okay? So, now that we've got that out of the way, let's talk about consistency. Consistency, what a beautiful word that is. I honestly think that people should call me Mr. Consistent and not the real estate dingo because if anything, I'm not the smartest guy out there. I quit school at a very young age. I can't type, I can't read, I can hardly write, and my math is absolutely atrocious. Um, I was never really that talented in anything either. Um, I couldn't run. Um, my lung capacity was always smaller than anyone else's, but miraculously, I became a professional soccer player. And let me tell you how, guys, and we're gonna summarize that success and your success with one word, and that is consistency. You have to stay consistent in absolutely everything you do. Stop changing the story in your head. Commit to one thing and stay consistent with it. It is do or die. You have to be desperate and you have to be willing to deal with whatever the consequences are. And you have to be consistent in your actions every 15 minutes, right? That's what our goals and targets are. Every hour, every week, every month, every year, you have to stay consistent with whatever it is that you're looking at achieving. So let's look at some of our real estate investors out there and how they can stay consistent in some of the things that they're doing. Bird dogs. Bird dogs have to stay consistent with constantly scouring the market and looking for new deals. Wholesalers need to stay consistent with constantly sending out direct mail yellow letters every single week, every single month, calling back, following up. Consistency is key to that. Buy, fix and flippers have to stay consistent with their contractors because contractors are known to run and steal your money. So you always have to be checking up on them. Stay consistent with hiring and firing. Stay consistent with inspecting their jobs before you give them a draw. Buy and hold investors need to stay consistent with ensuring that their tenants are paying the rent on time, that they are fixing any repairs that the tenants need fixed, that they are constantly following up with their tenants and seeing how things are going, giving them a little gift, buying them a little Christmas card, whatever it is to keep them staying and paying. And my awesome fellow realtors out there, they need to stay consistent with shaking hands and kissing babies. I mean, guys, 
You constantly have to be promoting yourself. You constantly have to be telling people who you are and what you're doing. I mean, your personal brand is the most important thing that you can portray into the world and you have to stay consistent with your message. Look at me for example, and I've said it in a previous blog, you either love me or you hate me. There's no in between, but at least I'm consistent. I'm rude, I'm raw, I'm passionate, and I'm a ball of energy. And that is what I've been portraying from the day I started, and that is pretty much what I'm going to be portraying absolutely forever. I don't want to change. Take me as I am, or watch me as I go. And that pretty much concludes our blog for today, guys. Please stay consistent in everything you do. You don't need any talent. Hard work beats talent any single day. I promise you that. Um, just look at me as an example. So once again, stay consistent in everything you do every minute of every day and you will succeed. And that's pretty much it guys. That concludes our blog for today. I would love to hear from you. Please comment below. Any new topics that you want me to cover, please comment below. Let's get an exchange of comments going. I'm going to reply to everyone um, and that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Once again, I'm Angela Rumora. I'm your favorite Australian and the real estate dingo. You guys have a great day.